Hello everybody, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today we are watching Gran Torino. Hi, welcome, my name is Camilla, I'm 21 and I post Let's Plays every Wednesday and reactions on Saturdays. Today we're watching Gran Torino, don't really know what it's about. Um, It's released 2008, yeah. That's what I know. I've had a very rough day. I am absolutely so tired. So I got my blanket. We got some snacks. And we're just going to chill because we deserve it. So if you'd like to watch the movie together with me and watch the full reaction, it's over on my Patreon. Link down below. If you want to check me out on other social media, also link down below. Other than that, let's just start watching Gran Torino. <laughs> Spectacles, testicles, wallet, and watch. <laughs> point I'm trying to make is that there's nothing anyone can do that won't disappoint the old man. You know, that's why we stopped doing Thanksgiving. I heard that every single Thanksgiving family dinner in America, there's always drama. Is that dad? No. That's Grandpa Walt. Third Platoon E Company, March 2nd, 1952, Korea. Easy Company. He just lost someone. Why is everyone being so rude? Yeah, it's probably strict, but you guys are being who? Using your phone, being disrespectful in the church when it's something that means a lot to him. Grandpa, when did you get the uh, vintage car? I never knew you had a cool old car. So, what are you gonna do with it when you, like, die? Bruh. Then what about that super cool retro couch that you have in the den? Because I was thinking I'm going to state next year and I think it would look really good in my dorm room and I don't have any furniture at all. Oh yeah, she's in that age. Hi, what do you want? I live next door. Come on, get the shit out of your mouth. I have some respect, Zipperhead. We're in mourning here. That's the ritual the tradition, I should say, when a child is born. Why was it brown? I think you're an overeducated 27 year old virgin who likes to hold the hands of old ladies who are superstitious and promises a maternity. Well, at least he was being honest about it, so I guess that's good, right? <laughs> I commented about the handgun and this guy comes out with a freaking submachine gun. Why are you doing women's work? What do you want? Can't just come and talk to my little cousin? No. Hey, so how old are you anyway? Mentally, I'm way too old for you. What? <laughs> These are stupid. I'm going inside. Back in the day, everybody used to want to beat me up, dude. But now look, nobody want to fuck with me. Come on, man, let's go. We're cuz, right? He doesn't want to be part of it. I would told me a oh, boy next door got a badass mother. Oh, he has to steal oh it. God. Come on. Nice. Asshole. What the hell do you know about life and death? Lived for almost three years in Korea with his bikes. We shot men, stabbed them with bayonets, hacked 17 year olds to death with shovels. If I'll remember till the day I die. It's called a war. And what about life? I survived the war. Got married, had a family. Yeah. Sounds like you know a lot more about death than you do living. He served his country. You are living because of him. Maybe so. You're safe because of his work, no? 
son of a bitch. Oh yeah. Thieves. Oh! What are you guys doing out here, man? Minding our own business. Can I just come hang out with my little cousin? Oh, shut up, man. You're using him for sh stuff like that, for stealing. Get up. Get off my lawn. Man, you don't want to fuck with me. Did you hear me? I said get off my lawn now. Are you fucking crazy? Go back in the house. A literal child is trying to beef with a veteran? You dumb as hell, man. It's crazy. Thank you. Get off my lawn. He should train him up. Teach him to be badass and tough. Because Walt is the toughest cookie I've seen. Walt, you absolute doofus! What are you doing? Because you saved Tao. I didn't save. You anybody. did though. I just, I kept a bunch of jabbering gooks off of my lawn. Well, you're that's a hero all. to the neighborhood. I'm not a hero. <laughs> Too bad they think you are, and that's why they keep bringing you the gifts. Please take them. Well, they're wrong. Now I just want to be left alone. Thank you. I'm sorry. Sorry for what? For trying to steal your car. You step on this property again. You're done. In Ten bucks for the last five years, you hard-nosed Polak son of a bitch. Yeah, we'll keep the change. See you in three weeks, Brick. Not if I see you first, dipshit. <laughs> you, you here to bring me this little present? Nah. Another asshole who has a fetish for Asian girls? Ever notice how you come across somebody once in a while that you shouldn't have fucked with? That's me. The fuck? What the hell? <laughs> you need to put a finger out. Yeah. Oh, shit. There it is. What is all this bro shit anyway? Take care now. Yeah, you too. Yo, they got his respect. They are respecting him, I was trying to say. What's the matter with you, for Christ's sake? You're trying to get yourself killed. I thought you Asian girls were supposed to be smart. <laughs> you should be hanging out with your own people, with other Hmongs. Yeah. Hmong, not Hmong. Whatever. He's trying. Hmong, I, I mean Hmong, anyway. <laughs> it's the Vietnam thing. We fought on your side, and when the Americans quit, the communists started killing all the Hmong. So we came over here. Mongols over here fit in better. The girls go to college, and the boys go to jail. Hmm. Oh. <gasps> the hell is it with kids nowadays? Brats. People are like you, active and alert, but are alone and would benefit from being around folks their own age. It's his birthday, man. Why are we having this conversation? You know what we should have done? We should have stayed home with Josh and Ashley. Well, at least they were smart enough to not come. Our damn kids have more sense than we do. Uh, we miss Mama, don't we, Daisy? Aww. We're having a barbecue. You want to come over? There's tons of food. Just keep your hands off my dog. Oh, my God. Really? No, I'm kidding, you moron. You got beer too. He's like, oh. <laughs> Drink alone after all. It is my birthday. Really? Happy birthday, Wally. Don't call me Wally. He's so cute. <laughs> He's been staring at me the whole evening. That's Korku. He's a Lord Family Shaman. And what's that? Some sort of a witch doctor or something? He says that people do not respect you. They don't even want to look at you. Oh. 
The way you live, your food has no flavor. You're worried about your life. You made a mistake in your past life, but like a mistake that you did, you're not satisfied with? He says you have no happiness in your life. It's like you're not at peace. Don't beat him up, he's being very polite. Yeah, I'm uh, oh. Yeah, I'm fine. He's sick. <laughs> oh, he's sick. God, I've been more in common with these goofs than I do my own spoiled, rotten family. Happy birthday. Come on, you glutton. What for? To mingle. Oh, we're yeah. mingling right here. He's happy here. You know, I knew you were a dipshit the first time I ever saw you, but I never thought you were relax. with women than you are at stealing cars. Toad. It's not Toad, it's Tao. My name is Tao. <gasps> I may not be the most pleasant person to be around, but I got the best woman who was ever on this planet to marry me. I Aww. worked at it. It was the best thing that ever happened to me, hands down. But you, you know, you're letting Click Clack, Ding Dong, and Charlie Chan just walk out with Miss What's-Her-Face. Ooh. Yum yum. Oh my God, <laughs> Is this that chicken dumpling thing? Oh, oh. Mm -hmm. it's better than beef jerky, I'll tell you. Oh yeah. It's very important to my mom that you accept, and it would be an insult if you refuse. Why is this being put back on me all of a sudden? He's the one who tried to steal my car. Alia, if he doesn't want to do it, then, then let's just go. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Damn. See that tree right there? You just go over there and count the birds. You want me to count the birds? He's being sarcastic. One. Two. Oh, he actually. I would do the same. How long do I have you for? Till next Friday. Go get the ladder out of the garage. I'm tired of looking at it the last three years. Grandpa says he wants to know if you can have told clear out the big wasp. Nest under our porch. She's so cute. She did so good. Hey, Dad. Rich, it's, uh, it's me, your dad. I know. What's up? How's everything going? He found something. Fine. Everybody's everybody's great. Doing, doing fine. Good. How about work? He wants to talk about normal stuff. Yeah, I suppose. In fact, um... Uh, Speaking of busy, uh, I got a whole... Are you kidding? Don't you hear? Your dad never calls you, man. So, uh, why don't you call me this weekend? It was nice talking. You can call me, Walt. Thanks. Yeah. and you push and help me push it up each step. Now listen to me, Zip. Now you listen, old man. I'm here because you need help. So it's either top or I'm out of here. Uh... It's just like you know. Kind of ironic, huh? What? So watching the car that he tried to steal from you? <laughs> and you're a good man. I'm not a good man. Well, what kind of job could I ever get? Nobody would ever hire you. Well, how about construction? Construction? Yeah. Do you have Alzheimer's or something? No. <laughs> he did good, didn't he? How you doing, Martin, you crazy Italian prick? Now that's how guys talk to one another. Now go on out and come back in and talk to him like a man. Oh, no. What's up, you old Italian prick? Get out of my shop before I blow your head off, you goddamn dick smoking goat! Have you lost your mind? That's what you said, men say. What should I have said then? Yeah, kid, why don't you start with, um, hi or hello? You guys are the worst teachers. I don't have a job, a car, or a girlfriend. I should have blown his head off when I had the chance. Yeah. Damn. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. I need a haircut. If you ain't too busy, you old Italian son of a bitch prick barber. Boy, does my ass hurt from all the guys in my construction job. Just under 3,200. Goddamn these. It ain't right. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, not this again. So it's true, you got a job. Why the fuck you gotta make me look bad, huh? Depends on my stuff. Smash it. my job. What's the phrase I'm looking for? Fuck him up. Oh yeah. Say it. Face. What the hell happened to you? Don't worry about it, okay? It's not your problem. Grabbed me a couple of days ago, right after I got off work. Cowards. Where's your cousin live? Imagine having such a depressing life, though. Not being anything in the world and just being an asshole. Imagine that. I'm sorry, I was supposed to be all like ladylike and I'm talking shit. I'm so sorry. It's the deal. You stay away from Tao, understand? I just get so angry, you know? And I know it's just a movie, or it's just a movie. I'm getting feelings over it, like anger, so it's good. But it's really annoying me. How do you want your dog? I mean, the uh, steak. I told you, we only eat cats. Beautiful women, great food, and even Tao isn't bugging me. Yeah. Yeah. The world is such a dad right now for him. Can you guys give him a break? Someone go ahead. Is everybody all right? Where's grandma? Where's Sue? Where's Sue? Here, do it. She's not there. Where is she? Okay, sorry, but how are you going to convince me that everything is happening for a reason, you know? If I was Tao, I guess I'd want vengeance. I want to stand shoulder to shoulder with you and kill those guys. Are you not a priest? Why are you saying this? I want a beer. I love one. Some of the chests right. are over there behind you. I thought this was going to be a happy movie. <laughs> not happy. I was never very close with my two sons. I don't know him. I, I didn't know how. That's it? That's it. it. Bothered me most of my life. Thirteen, maybe more. What was it like to kill a man? You don't want to know. I'll close it up. The only thing worse is getting a Medal of Valor for killing some poor kid that wanted to just give up, that's all. Yeah, some scared little gook just like you. I but you got your whole life ahead of you. Me, I finish things. That's what I do. And I'm going it alone. Wow! Wow! Watch my dog. Uh, yeah, I love you too. Dad, yeah, she's old too. My name is Daisy. Swap rats in there. I didn't think your ass would have came. Shut up, Goop. Nothing to say to you. Shrimp dick, midget like you. You go ahead, watch out for your boyfriend. Because it was either he or you or someone who raped one of their own family. Your own blood, for Christ's sake. Don't worry about Tao. Tao's got not one second for you. What the fuck you gonna do, old man? <laughs> Kind of jumpy, aren't we? I'll 
the light? Me, I've got a light. Hail Mary, full of grace. It was just a lie. What were you trying to do, man? What were you trying to do? What were you trying to do? You don't get to die like that! Yes, Sergeant. What happened? You need to step back. He's a friend of mine. He said step back. Hey. Hey, did you hear him? Step back. It's the yeah. guy. He's my friend. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, He sacrificed himself for his people. I'll say it again. I thought this was a happy movie. I'm not happy. Walt Kowalski once said to me that I didn't know anything about life or death because I was an over-educated 27-year-old virgin. I knew really nothing about life or death until I got to know Walt. And boy, did I learn. And I want to leave my house to the church because Dorothy would have liked it. Now, which brings us to our last item. And again, please excuse the language. Gran Torino is going to the kid. How would the service it? I'd like to leave my 1972 Gran Torino to... Of course not you. Bruh. My friend, Tao Van Lore. Yes. If you can refrain from doing any of that, it's yours. Yes, Tao. He still has a girl on his right side, you know. <gasps> oh, I can't believe you've done this to me. Can I just say that I'm so happy I decided not to do my makeup for this video? It beats a lonely rhythm. But I was still crying my eyes out. Oh, I can't. Beats now I'm even more heartbroken. This was so painful. <laughs> Is this movie probably going to leave me emotionally scarred? Yes. Will I probably watch it again? Yes. Am I going to think about this for a long time now? No, absolutely. You... Uh, this one was heavy. Like, actually so heavy. An absolute... This movie was a masterpiece and I loved it i'm not gonna lie i absolutely loved it it's bringing out all the feelings when people get mad at movies i heard that they're like oh i don't like it because it was pissing me off but for me i feel like a movie is good when characters and actors make me feel some sort of feeling in general it could be love hatred anger comfort anything like that then I know they've done their job and they've done a good job. Here, I got all the feelings and the casting did such a good job with this movie. I'm gonna cry for two weeks now. <laughs> oh lord. Would you like to watch my full reaction to this?
It's probably just gonna be a sob fest. I'm I'm crying most of the movie. Who cares? <laughs> but if you want to have someone to cry together with, you can find my full reaction over on Patreon. All my social media is also linked down below, such as my Twitch, my Instagram, Discord, everything is linked down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. It's been lovely. Feeling much more comfort with my channel, being able to post gaming and reactions and vlogs, reading content. That I can even sit and record without makeup and sitting crying on YouTube. Imagine that. Thank you guys so much for being a part of this. I'm excited to see what's gonna be next week's movie. That was it, everybody. Thank you guys so, so, so much for watching. I wish you a wonderful rest of day or week, morning, night. And I hope to see you in my next video very, very soon. Bye, everyone.